welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not here, como están mis amores? Today's video happened like a month ago. It is a room tour of when I lived with my roommate because we now have our own apartment. <laughs> like what? I'm still in like disbelief. I'm still in shock that it even happened because everything just happened so fast. And even though I've been looking for an apartment since the beginning of January, I signed my lease on Valentine's Day, February 14th. And even then I was like, whoa, like I can't believe we're actually doing this. Like we're actually doing this. This is my first big girl move by myself and I've decorated the place so nicely. I can't wait to show you guys. But first I have to roll out the videos in order. So this video will be my room tour of when I lived with my roommate. And then from this video forward, will be my moving vlogs and how I've decorated the place. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So this is the door that you walk in and behind the door I just have one hook and my towel. Right next to the door I have this beautiful huge world map piece that I just love how seamlessly it blends in with the wall. I sometimes forget it's even there. Then I have these three hooks here that I keep my robes on. Right now there's only one robe on it and my little evil eye is up there as well. Over here I have four mandalas on the wall right next to my closet and I just thought it was cute decoration and I love how nice and subtle and beige everything is in the hallway. Now onto my closet. So everything in my closet is color coded. Up here I have all of my bags and my hats. I put that shelf up myself just so I could have more storage up there. Then in the middle there I have a evil eye dream catcher and some of my bigger t-shirts folded. And then off to the side I have sweatpants and other type of dress pants and my towels all the way up there. Off to the side over here are all of my dresses and then we go into tank tops and crop tops, all of my long sleeves and button up and jackets back there. In these three boxes I have all of my workout clothes so in here are all of my leggings, sports bras, and workout shorts or tennis skirts. And then this is the IKEA Mom 3 drawers in black. And in here I keep all of my pants. So these are like colored dressier pants. These are all of my jeans. And down here are all of my skirts as you can see. It is busting out the drawer. I have a lot of skirts. Off to the left over here, I have all of my shoes, which I'm so excited to have more shoe storage. Anything from sneakers to sandals to boots. It looks unorganized, but I promise you it's very much organized. It's an organized mess over there. And then in this little corner, it's called Neverland because everything gets lost over there. That's just like backup storage. And as for the lighting in my closet, I found this strip of lights at Marshall's for like $12 and it's powered by my electric. So if I were to say, Echo, closet off, it turns it off for me. So when I come into my room and I say, Echo, lights on, it turns on all the lights in my room. And I absolutely love how it just illuminates the whole closet so I can see better. Because this hallway light, I hate big lights. Like just look how intense that light is. You will see it's a reoccurring theme here to have lamps and soft lighting over big lights. So that's pretty much my whole closet. I believe I'm gonna have to move all of this clothes. So going further into the room, we're gonna start at the right side right here. So this is what I like to call my little kitchen area. I have this mini fridge that I got from Target for like a hundred bucks, it was on sale. And right now it's a mess because I'm defrosting it. As you can see, all the water from the little freezer just melted. But because I live with roommates, I liked having this little fridge here for things that I would like to keep in my room. So like my poppy, I have some chocolate, some lip mask, eye masks, my serums, my tart cherry juice to make my sleepy girl mocktails, some wan. And then on top of the fridge, I have my tea kettle. And then these are pretty much all of the dishes that I use. I have an assortment of teas back there, my vitamins and a paper towel roll. This print I got off of, I think Society6. This was back when I had my first ever apartment with my ex. So this was like a good six years ago. I don't know if it's still available, but I do love her. And then on top of her, I have these two hooks holding all of my baseball caps. And next to the baseball caps, I have this little assortment of bags over here. I just really loved the colors all together and I wanted to display my purses in a really cute way. The top bag is from Amazon. This one, it's an all 
Aldo bag. I got it at Marshalls or TJ Maxx. And this computer tote bag, you guys have seen me with it. Anytime that I grab my laptop, I grab this bag because it's huge and I could put my purse in it and my water bottle in it. And that one I got on Amazon as well. So I just keep them there for decoration. Next we have my, I think it's called a TV stand, but in reality, it's just a whole Ikea set stacked on top of each other. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So these eight boxes down here is all one. It's the Calyx storage unit from Ikea. So these eight boxes are one. And then these four boxes are one, which I actually had this one standing up in a corner over there. But then I decided to put it on top of this one and put my TV on. It. And then these four boxes are one unit. So it's actually three units, but I just love how everything is organized in them and very flush to the wall too, because I need all the storage I can get in this small little space. I'm gonna go through it quickly. This is my fish tank. I'll be getting a new fish soon. If you know about my last fish, it passed away. So now I just have my two little snails in there. That's why there's still water in there. I actually can't find them. Oh, there is one of them but I will be getting a new fish soon. As you can see, I'm obsessed with anything Buddha. And then over here, I have a propagated pothos that's actually been there forever. She is a daughter of this mother plant over here. And then I have this huge Samsung TV. I think it's 55 inch. Then here on the side of the TV, I had my snake plant over there, but she withered away. So I have to get a new one. And then I have my little Alexa here, the one that shows the time on it, and my whole perfume collection right underneath my TV. On the left side, I have another Buddha head and my crystals and Palo Santo and sage and all of that. Back there, I have my Himalayan salt lamp, which actually, let me turn it on. I love turning on the salt lamp and the LED lights behind my TV. Yeah, it's too light out for you to be able to see. Or actually right here, I love that the fish tank kind of like brings out all of the colors. It looks like a sunset. It's so stunning. Then right next to my TV, I have this shelf. There's these three little hats that I have there displayed a sunglasses rack, a little porcelain doll from Dominican Republic, a vase with some fake flowers in it, and a picture of me, my mom, and my dad on my 16th birthday, and my money tree back there too. Underneath it is my fiddle leaf fig. She's actually thriving right now. And then this is pretty much all of my hair stuff because I like to do my hair in front of this mirror. So it's nice that I just have everything conveniently right there. And this mirror also came with my room. Don't judge my appearance, okay? I am in moving mode, so there's no mascara, no concealer, no nothing today, okay? Not even lip gloss. My lips are so dry right now. And my pothos hanging up there from the same Ikea hanging pot thing. Then to the side of it, I have my withering plants that I have neglected for so long. They look so sad. I'm gonna insert a video of them when they were like plush and, and beautiful. But honestly, I have been neglecting them badly. So I am gonna bring them to the new place with me to see if I can try to revive them. I mean, this one most definitely but this one, girl, she is Gerard out. And then I have my air purifier because in this room, the air quality is not the best. And I will start sneezing up a storm if I did not have this air purifier. And then we have my huge window. I love having big windows in a place because I love natural lighting. And I have all these little twinkly lights all around it. They're actually just white Christmas lights, but actually all of these lights are powered by my Alexa as well. Echo, lights off. These are the same lights that are connected with my closet as well. Echo, lights on. I love technology. Also, my mirror has lights around it as well that with a push of a button right here, as you can see, they turn on. This is the lamp that is behind my mirror and the bulbs are what connect to the internet as well as the Alexa. Then turning right over here, we have my desk area. On top of it, I have my mood board up there. So she's not a vision board. She's actually just a mood board. I have a separate vision board, but I just love anything that has like neutral colors on it. There's like a girl doing yoga on there. There's a girl doing skincare with Sage, or actually that's Palo Santo. There's a girl on a boat taking a selfie, a picture of the wings of a plane, a girl that looks like she's in her own apartment, which I've manifested. Cute little quotes written all over the mood board. So I love having that up there. And yet again, another pothos in the same hanging pot. But this one, I actually cut off the black strings that this one has. And I found this crocheted one, I think at five below 
and I absolutely love it. Over here I have my calendar and my whiteboard. This little honeycomb looking lamp I got at Ikea. The corner shelf I got at Five Below. This mirror I got on Amazon. The little shelf that it's standing on I actually made it myself from a wood plank at Lowe's. I had them cut it for me and everything. And then I just attached it with those metal brackets. And then on each side of it I just have some skincare. That's my everyday makeup bag down here. As you can see it just has all my everyday makeup my brushes inside this Pisces mug and then the actual desk is from Target my boyfriend actually got it for me and then I have my carry-on luggage down there that it's what I pretty much travel with always and she I got on Amazon as well a little stand-up magnifying mirror my makeup kit down there for when I have clients and then I have a bag full of supplies back there for when I do my blowout clients in their house and then a trash bin and these little booties that are usually under my bed and then my bed frame I think is also from Ikea, but I'm not sure because it was here when I moved in. The duvet cover is from Amazon. The pillow I think is from Target. Green pillows are from Ikea. Satin pillows are from Amazon. And the pillows back there came with the duvet cover. I got this pillow thing from Walmart and this little husky dog. My boyfriend got it for me for Valentine's Day last year. And we call him Timpano or Pesto because we went on a date there last year and it's this restaurant in Tampa that we love. And we had the pesto pasta, so we named Named him Pesto, but we also call him Timpano. So he has two names. And then this fun little collage over here is all from Ikea. All the frames are from Ikea as well as the shelf that it is sitting on. I am leaving this here because, frankly, because I don't feel like taking it off the wall and bringing it with me. So I'm just gonna leave it here with my roommate and whoever rents the room next can do whatever they want to it. But overall, my theme was just like greenery and the finer things, you know? So that's why I printed all of these prints myself at costco.com which actually they've now bonded with shutterfly so if you have a costco membership you'll get a discount on shutterfly.com so that's where i printed all of these prints from and then because i don't have side tables i got this on amazon and it's literally my favorite thing ever i get to place my drinks there when i'm in bed i have my eye mask the led light remote the fan remote chopsticks and stuff actually i need some chopstick right now my tv remote it's just a nice cute little side table to have especially when you don't have nightstands then i have my apple watch here and these cables too are my iphone charger and my ipad charger and honestly that's pretty much it for the room i just love the vibes in here I love the warm tones, all the wood. It's just, it's a vibe. This little corner right here is like heaven. Oh, and underneath my bed, it's literally all storage. I keep all of my Kirkland water bottles down here, all my poppy, my leftover poppy because I get the bulk order from Costco, the kind bars also. But yeah, down here, it's pretty much all storage, which I'm excited to not have to store things under my bed in my new place. So thank you guys so much for watching and be sure to check out my new New empty apartment tour and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!